All right, so I got my new router all, all the parts assembled from the box ready for assembly. Um, everything came pretty packed, pretty nice, and three separate boxes that were about 30 pounds each, roughly. These are the side gantries. This is bottom support for the gantry, and then all the boxes that came labeled, stepper motors, ball nut screw, the router spindle mount, controller, power supply, wire, Z-axis assembly, which comes assembled. I got 25 millimeter trucks, rails on all uh, all axis. Um, this is the X and the Y here, so um, this is the, this is the Y, it's the X. It uses a T-slot, so um, 20 millimeter ball screw, precision ball screw using for uh, that no lead screw no lead screw um, but everything comes numbered here you can see number fours these are number fives parts over here number six and inside here like stepper motors Z axis here and so ball screws here. So it comes in boxes like this and then you just gotta follow the directions here. Checklist of everything that's included so um, but this will allow me to do a lot more aluminum work faster and uh, stronger because of the, uh, the kind of material it's being it's used. The gantry is a half inch solid sheet of aluminum not forged or casted or anything. It's uh, CNC one sheet, sixty sixty one uh, half inch thick. So that's pretty pretty good. And the same thing for the rest of it. It's using T, T <coughs> excuse me T slot and uh, all good parts. So all these supports on the ends here are half inch also. Today, so, guess what? Let me just finish up this video. So I'm going to go ahead and start assembly, but I just wanted to show. So far, the unassembled.